Cooking Alex, the irreverent but not irrelevant cooking show on YouTube. Hey, uh, so here are uh, here I am visiting another person's home uh, at in uh, the city of Duquesne, Pennsylvania, and we are just quickly going to have some uh, dinner, very nice dinner here, and uh, just a very nice stir fry. And uh, what again do you call it? Carrots and zucchini. Okay, carrots and zucchini. Uh, this is my host here, Catherine. Uh, uh, carrots and zucchini, as I just showed you on the thing, we have the, uh, we, uh, what do you call this preparation here? Matchstick cut zucchini. Okay, matchstick cut zucchini. And, and similar match, matchstick cut carrots. Okay, and then we have a little bit of uh, ginger. Ginger, right? and, ginger and garlic, equal amounts. Okay, okay. Uh, so uh, we'll let Catherine go ahead and start preparing this. She's going to be using a wok here on a gas stove. The wok is uh, preheated so it's pretty much ready to go. You can just dump it mm -hmm. around. Okay. And it's a matter of seasoning the oil with the ginger and the uh, garlic. I'll use half of it. I'm going to cook the carrots and the zucchini separately. I'll start with the zucchini. Now, why, why are you starting with the zucchini? Either's fine. You can choose either. Does, it be, does one cook uh, take longer to cook? I just want a couple minutes on this, so I'm going to watch the clock, and I'm going to do two minutes of stir-fry. Okay. As I'm cooking, um, just around the whole side of the pan, and add a little bit of salt to hold the color and bring out some flavor. Okay. Now, uh, why do you use a wok? The heat is nice. The size of the, of the pan, the whole surface is nice for cooking and it's quick. Okay. And while that's just melding flavors, I'll get a... Andrew, could you give me a big serving bowl for this? And I'm watching the clock for about a minute and a half, two minutes. Now I see you're just constantly stirring that? That's it. That's the easy technique of this pot. It's just... Nothing's overdone. The vegetables are crisp. Thank you. And really, a minute does it. Hmm. I'll take those out. And what kind of oil there are you using? Just a plain uh, cooking olive oil. Nothing, um, nothing above um, a reasonable price. We'll put in the remainder of the garlic and the uh, ginger. Hmm. We'll put in the carrots. You can use up, up to six teaspoons of oil between both fryings, but I try not to because it's just too much. <clears throat> now, why do you cook the uh, vegetables separately? So you get a, flavor, a full flavor from each vegetable. This vegetable, uh, zucchini got the salt for seasoning. This is going to get sugar for seasoning. Okay. For to bring out its to help caramelize the carrots as they cook. What does caramelize mean? Brown. Brown. Now you're adding a little bit of organic sugar. Yep. I'm just going to put like. I'm going to sprinkle around two ta like a tablespoon. And I'm going to watch for a minute. That's really all the more you want. And this starts to get a little sticky. That's why you do the zucchini first. Okay.
to the end of the hook with a microwave clock right at your door, right, right beside you. I see that. There's your clock right over there. Yeah. And now we've got the carrots done. We're going to turn off the heat and put the zucchinis and carrots together. And that's carrots with zucchini. Very nice. And that's uh, Cooking Alex. Alex Landefeld, your host. Have a good evening.